Okay, listen. I'm going to read you these lyrics, okay? Because if you read them in their entirety, it is not talking about following Satan. And if sex was a sin, your parents would be going to hell. Because how do you think you were made? Sex before marriage is a sin, but it is not a major sin. So it can be forgiven if it is not done twice. Okay? I believe in God, same as you. Okay? And this song has a deeper meaning than what you think. If you actually went online and read the lyrics, you would understand. Okay? So that's why I'm going to read them to you. I'm going to start at the first verse, just so you know. <clears throat> when he comes to me, I am ready. I'll wash his feet with my hair if he needs. Forgive him when his tongue lies through his brain. Even after three times he betrays me. Oh, 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 oh I'll bring him down, bring him down, down. Oh, 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 A king with no crown, king with no crown. I'm just a holy fool. Oh, baby, he's so cruel, but I'm still in love with Judas, baby. I'm just a holy fool. Oh, baby, he's so cruel, but I'm still in love with Judas, baby. Oh, 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 I'm in love with Judas, Judas. And that repeats, of course you know that. I couldn't love a man so purely, even prophets forgave his crooked way. I've learned love is like a brick. You can build a house or sink a dead body. Oh, 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 I'll bring him down, bring him down, down. Oh, 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 a king with no crown, king with no crown. I'm just a holy fool, oh baby, he's so cruel, but I'm still in love with Judas, baby. I'm just a holy fool, oh baby, he's so cruel, but I'm still in love with Judas, baby. Oh, 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 I'm in love with Judas, Judas. Oh, 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 I'm in love with Judas, Judas. In the most biblical sense, I am beyond repentance. Fame hooker, prostitute, wrench, vomits her mind. But in the cultural sense, I just speak in future tense. Judas kiss me in offense. Offen offense. Or wear an ear condom next time. Okay. That's kind of racy. Okay, it's kind of raunchy. I agree with that part. I want to love you, but something's pulling me away from you. Jesus is my virtue. Judas is the demon I cling to. I cling to. I'm just a holy fool. Oh, baby, he's so cruel. But I'm still in love with Judas, baby. I'm just a holy fool. Oh, baby, he's so cruel. But I'm still in love with Judas, baby. Okay. That is that song. Tell me, where in that? Does it say that she's a Satanist? Okay. Yes, there's rumors going around that she's a Satanist, but I don't believe it. Because if you are a Satanist, okay, and you follow Satan, and you worship Satan, and all this other stuff, why would you say Jesus is my virtue? Or you're a holy fool? Hmm? Why, why exactly would you say that? Some of the stuff she does, yes, I agree. It is kind of out there, and it's kind of, you know sexual but how she dresses and what she does there's a deeper meaning to it if you sat down and watched an interview with her for El on Ellen okay she talks about the reason why she dresses the way she does is because when people see her or she goes to a concert or she performs at a concert or whatever she wants people to feel like they're not alone okay because honestly I don't dress like good Christian or Catholic girl should. Okay. I've got a punk rock sexy kind of style. Okay. I agree some of her stuff is, you know, inappropriate. Okay. But this song, like you heard me reading it, it one, it does not talk about sex. I don't know where you got that from. Two, it does not specifically say she's a Satanist. Because, like I said, if you're a Satanist, why the hell would you say Jesus is my virtue? Does that make any sense to you? 
the purpose behind this song is that okay sin is very tempting it is it is very tempting okay she's basically saying I want to you know follow sin and uh, like sin is so tempting but something's pulling her away from it which is Jesus hence Jesus is my virtue but Judas is the demon I cling to you've got to listen to the deeper meaning of the song before you start doing this because one I'm a songwriter I can understand the deeper meaning of songs two okay read the song lyrics okay because at first I thought it said I'm just a horny fool okay but I just looked the lyrics up and it says holy fool okay I agree with some of the stuff that she does is kind of wrong and kind of out there and kind of you know inappropriate for younger people but honestly I'm 21 years old once you get to the age of accountability which is 12 you should be able to make your own decisions whether or not this is right okay because honestly if you know that's wrong then everything on TV is wrong you know the world is full of sex these days the world is full of sin there's nothing you can do to avoid it and you're not perfect either you've probably sinned in your lifetime you know no one's perfect so before you start criticizing someone's music and saying that it's Satanist or that it's bad, you know, you should freaking read the lyrics all the way through fully. Like, read the lyrics, not listen to the song. Read the lyrics before you start making all these accusations because I am a fan of Gaga, okay? But I'm not going to hell. Okay? You have... The choice. God makes you have the choice to be able to decide whether or not this is right or wrong. You can pray and ask them if this is right. Okay? You need to understand the deeper meaning in her music before you make judgments like that. Yeah, Bad Romance, that video was kind of, you know, and so is Alejandro. Alejandro was pretty. Now, some of the stuff she does, I don't agree with, like I said. But before you start criticizing someone's music, you really should read the lyrics. Read the lyrics. Okay, and if you have, okay, another thing. If you had a problem with Lady Gaga with her Battle Romance video, why the hell listen to her other music? If you had a problem with her the first time you listened to her, why listen to her a second time? That don't make sense. This is my response to you, and I have to make this short now because I'm almost on nine minutes. So, I hope and pray that you stop being stupid and read the lyrics before you make all these accusations.